that falls on Janet Yellen. She doesn't work for the American people. She works for Joe Biden. Joe Biden is our commander in chaos. <laughs> and I, I, know, I, I don't mean that in a funny well, way. What, 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 Every, no, what, everything that that man has done since he took the oath of office has been purposeful suffering and hardship on the American people. And she, Janet Yellen can go out and sell the gold reserves. That's more than half a trillion dollars. That would pay our bills in the United States for four months because we're running a one and a half trillion dollar budget deficit right now. So there are a lot of things that she could do that the people in charge of government could do to prioritize payments. But would they do it? No, because they're spiteful and they don't care about suffering and hardship and financial catastrophe and calamity on the American people. And I think that Kevin McCarthy showed that Republicans with even the slimmest of majorities are capable of governing. And if you want more power and you want more cuts, you want to right this country financially, you win races. Yeah. All right. You're playing, well, you're playing chicken with people who do not care about the safety but and you're soundness. The you're, you're the chicken that actually has the weapon to pass the bill and raise the debt ceiling. You mean if Republicans, well, it they passed. They raised the debt ceiling. Democrats didn't pass any bill. They passed it out. Uh, financial markets crash. Yeah, and people would not get their Social Security payments. I don't believe that would have been true, only because Fox Business, you're. you're are, about. Why are we spitting on a win for Republicans? This was a win for Republicans, Sean. It really was. Listen, what did the I Democrats understand. get in this? What did the Democrats get in this? Well, I'll tell you, uh, they got $87 billion for yeah.